kommer för sent på den här. Men då kommer vi väl för sent då, då får vi vänta. Hemmer han för? Mm. Nej. Han verkar kunna sig ärlig, tror jag. Är det han du alltid snackar med honom? Mm. Och vem är hon? Varför frågar du om henne hela tiden? För det. Att det gör mig en liten bit som när vi är i kul och hundra. Sluta stressa upp dig. Det här är bara helt vanligt. De är glada, nöjda. De verkar inte vilja ha någonting. Okay? Precis därför är jag nervös. Jag skulle inte ställa upp med folk från det. Och jag tror jag är på det. Men du vet, alla är inte lika hemska som du är älskling. Jesus. Men för att vara oansett om de är tillfredsa. Eller om de mangler något så kommer de till det. Vad tar fram med det jag har här? I need suits mostly. No, I imagine yeah. it must be exciting to work in government. It's like a spy movie. <laughs> Can you read my secret emails? Mm, no. <laughs> my job is mostly paperwork and bureaucracy. They always want more than the technology allows. I don't even have time to read your secret emails. <laughs> But it's a stopgap. For me, I'm restless. So. Always itching for something else. There have been a lot of something else's. <laughs> for both of us. Mm -hmm. Before this, I worked at an NGO. And before that, I worked at a Microsoft for a year, which felt like a decade. <laughs> <laughs> Your place is beautiful. I wish I could take the compliment. The decorating is Scott's domain. No, really? Yes. Very nice. Yeah. Where's all the, the antiques from? Uh, there's... So there they tapped you for CTO, yes? Don't be surprised. <laughs> Suspicious is more accurate. Mm -hmm. I was beginning to wonder why you said this dinner. Four people in the world know about my conversations. Somehow, you're number five. And I'm exactly what you need in a right hand. So that's what this is about. Isn't everything about something? Like we were thinking about, is it, is it baby proof? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's, that's a consideration. If you were me, would you trust you as your right hand? If I were you, I wouldn't have even let me in the house. Uh -huh. Now a good time? Yeah. I'm at my new job. How's it going? Seriously, it's hard as hell. But I am getting the hang of it. At first it took me like years to marry ketchups, but it turns out I'm amazing at upselling expensive cocktails. I'm not surprised. And then when I have to put together to go orders, it's like bagging Molly, so I'm like kind of an expert. How are you? I'm good. Oh, I've never heard you say a sentence like that before, ever. I did what I had to do today. Well, if you're around tonight, come over and tell me about it, okay? I gotta go. Goodbye. seem to know how to drink your wine. I indulge in few things, but I do love wine. Yourself? In my other life, when I could drink for one. But even then, I had cheap tastes. It's uh, safe to smell, though. Put your nose in there. You know, to me, it smells like every wine. <laughs> but I'd love to learn. Uh -huh. Dried red fruit, fresh violet, uh, lemon peel. Try it again. Smell, really, really think about it. 
Mm, I do smell a lemon. Sharon? Yes? How do you not blow your brains out being married to him? Excuse me? Shall I repeat the question? You're a guest in our house. A very honest one. <laughs> wow. I think I'll mistake what you said as a joke in poor taste. I excuse myself to the bathroom. Now, I have a beautiful vintage over here. I would love to just show you the label. Nope. Nope. There's the one. This is my prized possession, actually. Take a look at this. I'm in here. Can I help you? Thank you for a lovely evening. 